Good morning students. I am Vetri Chelvi from Chemistry, <coughs> Simplified Tamil and Vetri and Vetri Nate Chemistry. Today I am going to give the level 2 question from the lesson of the chemical equilibrium. Nate and J. Let us go to the next page. Okay. The sun is, you can see the sun. Sun. The 1 mole of nitrogen is mixed with the 4 mole of 1 mole of <coughs> 1 mole of nitrogen is mixed with the 4 mole of hydrogen in a sorry with a 2 mole of 1 mole of nitrogen is mixed with the 2 mole of just I will mean, write again I will clean and write this is 2 mole 1 mole of nitrogen is mixed with the let me write 2 mole of hydrogen in a 4 liter vessel. If 50 percentage of nitrogen is converted into ammonia by the following reaction. Okay. Then the question is what do you want to say? Nitrogen 1 mole, 2 mole hydrogen, 4 liter vessel is in the vessel. Ammonia is in the vessel. 50 percentage of nitrogen is converted into ammonia by the following reaction. Okay. The reaction is ordinary Haber's process. Continuational question, what would be the value of Kc for the following equilibrium? So, what do you think about this equilibrium? What do you think about Kc value? The options are available. Let us go to how to approach the sum. Now, what do you think about this equilibrium? Now, the given equilibrium is written according to that you can see this one. Here, number of moles initial. That is, if you have to put the moles in the same place, Nitrogen gas 1, hydrogen gas 1, ammonia is not available at the initial. Then the amount of the gas reacted, nitrogen is 0.5. How I can say is 50 percentage is reacted is given. So out of 1, the 50 percentage is 0.5. Other than nitrogen reacted, I will give you 0.5. But I will give you what I will do based on the limiting reagent. Based on the limiting reagent. And then stoichiometric chemistry, stoichiometry you can see, 1 mole of nitrogen combined with the, what is given here is 1 mole is combined with the 3 moles of your hydrogen. If you are taking 0.5 moles of nitrogen, mean it will consume 1.5 moles of hydrogen. Okay, now here it is written is number of moles reacted, 0.5 moles of nitrogen react with 1.5 moles of hydrogen. So now this is the reactor. Number of moles at equilibrium. Now you can see the number of moles at equilibrium. That is remaining. 1 minus 0 0.5, 0 0.5, 2 minus 1.5, 0.5. And the amount of ammonia produced is based on the stoichiometric calculation. What is based on stoichiometry mean? If you take here the 1 mole of nitrogen, here the amount of ammonia is 2. If you are taking here 0 0.5 mean, the amount of nitrogen produced will be the 0.5 into 2. You will get the 1. So now you are getting the 1 based on this. Okay, how you are getting is based on stoichiometry. What is the stoichiometry is 0.5 into 2. That is called 1 mole of ammonia is formed. Now this is the number of moles at equilibrium. Next molar equilibrium means the number of moles at equilibrium. Divide the volume of the container. This, way, this step usually students to forget. So you have to be, be aware of this step. This step is very, very important. So 0.5 divided by 4 liter is the volume of the container. And this is also 4 liter. And you are getting the 1, 1 by 4. Now the, <coughs> what is here is concentration of the reactant and producer. Products are available. Now we have to move to the next one is. According to the law of mass action, K is equal to mass of the product by the reactant. The products is 1 by 4 is written in the ammonia. So, which is stoichiometry is 2, 1 by 4 the whole square. Nitrogen 0.5 by 4 and it is the hydrogen is that. Well, stoichiometry is 3. So, this is the basic knowledge. Next, following this, we are going to do the expansion of the sum. Let us go to the continuation of the sum. Okay. So, this is basic ordinary max only. Yes, now we are going to the 1 by 4. Okay. So, let me write 1 by 4 into 1 by 4 divided by. This is divided by. Next, you are having the 0 0.5. This one you are striking here. You just the same. 
moving the decimal here, I am putting the 1 0 here. So what we are getting is 1 by 8. So 0.5 by 4 you can write as a 1 by 8. So this is also on getting coming cancelling 1 by 8 you are getting. So now I am writing 1 by 8. Here it is 1 by 8 the whole cube. So now you can write as a next step. We can write now like this here it is 1 by 4 into 1 by 4 divided by 1 by 8 into 1 by 8 into 1 by 8 into 1 by 8. Now let us go for cancelling. Here it is coming to the 2 and this is cancelling with the 2. Okay. Now let us come continuation of the sum is there. Okay. Here it is everything I am getting is oh, let me write as 1 by 1. Here you are getting this side 1 by 2 into 1 by 2 into 1 by 8 into 1 by 8. Okay. Now let us go to the further continuation. 1 by 1 divided by 2 to the 4. 80 to the 64. Now I can write as a 1 by 4 into 1 by 64. Okay. Now you can get like this divided by 1 by 64. So now you are getting 264. Okay children. Now let us see the next step. Yes, the final step is all. We are in the final step. What you are having is 1 by 1. Divided by in the denominator you are having 1 by 264. For bringing here, so what you are having is the answer is 264. It is not an answer. This is the first step. So what we are getting is Kc for this equilibrium is 264. 264. Okay, now we have completed only the first level. I already told the sum is to the level of level 2 question. Now we can frequently expecting in the need 25 because the same pattern already you got need 24 also. Okay, now let us go to the question. What is question is here? They are asking the uh, equilibrium constant Kc. Now you can see the thing is here it is. Kc for the following equilibrium reaction. What is the following equilibrium reaction is? Ammonia dissociated give nitrogen and hydrogen. The number of moles of ammonia of this. For this the Kc value you see how to find out. Now let us go to the next page. Okay. Now what is the knowledge we are getting either from the previous pages? The Kc for the first equilibrium is 264. Now we are having the next equilibrium. So now it is the reverse of or I can say dissociation of ammonia gives nitrogen plus hydrogen. Since it is one more, you are taking off and here it is 3 by 2. So everything under the conditions. Okay. Now we have to find out our task is to find out the Kc for this one. Usually reverse of this. So for this, Kc is equal to reverse. Now let me write this is the Kc1. Let me write this is I am writing as a this is just a Kc1. Kc1 means what you should write is reversible of it is 264. And then so everything is divide by or I can say multiply or I can say divide by the equation divide by 2. The equation is divide by 2 or I can say multiply by 1 by 2. Okay, now I am taking multiply by 1 by 2. So under the condition, what we should write is to the power you should write the 1 by 2. So now what is the equilibrium constant for this given equilibrium is 1 by 264 the square root. Okay, square root of this. So what is the square root of 264 is 1 by 16. So now our answer is, let us go and verify the answer. Yes. Here it is available. The answer is here. It is 1 by 16. So like that, this is the level 2 question. Again I am repeating. Let us start from the first page. Okay children? Yes. The today is 27th May and the chemical equilibrium level 2 NEET and JE. We are preparing for the NEET 2025. Okay. The cosine is. Now let us see the cosine here. One mole of nitrogen is mixed with the two mole of hydrogen in a four liter vessel. Fifty percentage of nitrogen is converted to the ammonia by the following reaction. What will be the value? This still that they are asking is level one. 
and they are asking now for the reversible reaction casing so what they find out first the step one you have to find out the casing for this equation the plan next for this one reverse of this okay now let me write what is the plan is first step find out the casing for the first equilibrium reaction second step reverse of that we want to find out the reverse of casing that is 1 by casing and it is multiplied by 1 by 2 so put it 1 by 2 following this you will get the answer now let us see the how you are using that knowledge a very important thing you are writing is these steps are very important these steps, steps are very important initial numbers reacted number of moles of equilibrium and it is called molar concentration now this is ok divide by 4 don't forget it then you find kc as usual as the simplest manner you can put it the kc what i am getting is here it is what is 264 so what is our next work is next work is on the next page so what we are observing is this is the reverse and divide into 1 by 2 so reverse of it 1 by 2 is 64 and you are multiplied by the 1 by 2 so now let me write here this is multiply 1 any 1 you can take it now you are multiplying by 1 by 2 1 by 2 multiplying by 1 by 2 yes yes here already 2 so multiplying by 1 by 2 getting cancelled yes we are doing multiplying the equation equilibrium 1 by multiply by half so that you are putting here that half you are putting here ok so this half is because of this since you are multiplying by 1 by 2 so you are putting here so now remove this one mean what you have to put, put the square roots put the square root mean it has become 1 by 16 264 the square root is 16 so your answer is 1 by 16 thank you children